Assalamu alaikum beautiful people. Today in this short and practical video, I will guide you for seven common mistakes in the construction of this plinth beam. So let's get start guys. You can see this is plinth beam for three story commercial building. As you can see, the first mistake is they used here four steel rods, which dia is 12 millimeter. So this is the first mistake. So for commercial building, you can't use four steel rods. This is not a domestic building. The second mistake is, guys, you can see this is the junction for beam and column. You can see you can't see any development length for beam to make a good bond between steel and concrete. So this is the second. The third mistake, guys, you can see the spacing of stirrups, which is more than 12 inches, 30 centimeter. So guys here, you can see this is about 45 centimeter, sometime 30 centimeter, 40 centimeter. So this is the third mistake. So the fourth mistake is guys, you can see the stirrups. Hooks are bent with one, uh, not 135 degree, but it's bent on 90 degree. Guys, you can see clearly in the spacing also with L by four distance, you can't see uh, the stirrup spacing closely. If you see its junction, so they didn't use here uh, the extra bars because at the junction we should provide extra bars or cut piece because here we have maximum shear stresses. So guys, this is the poor construction of plinth beam for commercial building. Look here guys. The other mistake is guys size of the beam. Guys, you can see the width of this beam is uh, 9 inch. Okay. And the depth is also 9 inches. But remember the depth of the beam should be maximum compared to its width okay so this is the other if you see guys it's a, a concrete cover you can't see any concrete cover for this plinth beam so concrete cover is very important so it should be provided from 25 to 30 millimeter or one inch is very important for the beam okay you can see clearly guys look here this is the junction you can't see any development length and you can see the spacing of the stirrups. So the first stirrups should be placed with the distance or the spacing of two inches. But here all spacing for stirrups are more than 12 inches, more than 30 centimeters. So sometime 40 centimeters, you can see clearly hooks. Everything is wrong, guys. So why um, in most of the videos I'm discussing mistakes on construction site because you try uh, to fix those mistakes uh, during building construction or starting construction of uh, plinth beam, column, slab or anything, any RCC structure, okay? Look here guys, you can see clearly what's wrong in this construction of plinth beam, especially at steel reinforcement, as you can see.